Hey guys, it's F4. Um, at the giant spider mission right now. I'm trying to get me a giant spider at spawn. Show you guys how easy it is to kill it. And there it is. So I'm gonna go get it. Come on, big boy. Now a lot of people have been telling me, you know, it's impossible to kill a giant spider with a melee weapon. There's no way you can do it. Or at least out here. Wow. Saw that quick thinking. I was like, let's see, get hit by a giant spider with a fat guy. I guess I voted for the fat guy. Huh? Yeah, sometimes you gotta make that type of choice. But anyway, you know, if you really want to kill with a melee weapon, what you do is this. Simple as that. I recommend this with a corpse crusher. Or dust rays, or the highest damage one hit weapon you can find. And then, oh shit, once you get to something like this, you can use range. Or if you get to something like this, I recommend a chainsaw in this situation. And yep, that's it. That's all you have to do to kill the giant spider, really. Now I'm not gonna do the video of killing him with a saber, so let me just get out of this. And continue killing him because I need my EXP as fast as I can. I'm trying to get to 88. I'm at 81 right now. As you see, I'm at 56%. It's pretty good. Been here for like an hour or two. It's 8:06 p.m. right now. I got about what is that? A couple hours left for this. Oh, that sucks. I don't know why I did that. But I thought it'd be cool for me. All right. Well. Oh. That's how you kill a giant spider with all ways in like two minutes, as you see. It's pretty easy. This is the first block, top left corner. You just walk around that one area. Um, you keep watching, I'll show you another way to do it. Just give me a second. Giant spider did a number on me. Oh, only injured. Maybe I should take another one. A second. Oh, what the hell? I do recommend having 124 agility. You don't need the speed boost. I have it because it's just a lot easier to kill it with, you know, 100 agility. And the speed boost. I have 124 agility, I meant. So yeah, oops, my armor is broken too. Didn't even notice that. What is wrong with me today? Let's see. My back. Not as good as the first one, but you know, it's still pretty good. So once I get to 88. I'll just make a lot of money and once I think I have enough to have at least one EXP boost every day and 10,000 stack of grenade rounds then I think I'm pretty good I'm set to go for that one week and try to get top survivor that way. You know, I'm not too sure about this week. Even if I joined this week I think I would have got crushed because the top survivor recently well his exp right now is like a hundred million and that's just insane i could do like 50 million if i had all the money and you know all that crap but i don't know how the hell this guy did it you know why didn't i turn on my multiplayer and feel the target oh well uh give me a second guys probably gonna put a skip button in the bottom of the description There it is, alright. This is how you boss pool. Really. It's a good way to get EXP for weapons. Oh, what the fuck. Let's go over that again. Melee weapon? Simple. Walk, walk, walk. When he catches up, hit. Or you just stand still. Doesn't matter. See? Simple as that. 
recommend a Corpse Crusher or a Dachi or anything above a Katana or Battle Axe, you know, would work pretty well with this. And then there's the other way, which is this. I recommend a Chainsaw or something that hits fast. Maybe the Kuku or something like that. Uh, I didn't even suspect he was going to die like that, but, you know, shit happens. This is if I get another one. Pow. Oh, what the hell. Pow, pow. Everyone's going to die. Corpse you up there, no bullets, sadly. Wish I got my corpse grinder, but that's okay. Get that in a few levels. Gonna be sitting here for a while. Not gonna record all of it like I did before, because no one really watches the videos. I'll wait till my video get a little more popular with Dead Frontier, and then that's when I'll take a step out. To do a little more recording, but right now it's just time to time things. I'll record. Don't really like recording too much. Kind of give away the big secrets of how to play the game, you know. But that's with every game. As the years go by, the game gets easier and easier for everyone. Because the basics will just not be the basics, I guess. Spider. Just run up here and oh, there he is. You. Hey, ugly. I'm talking to you. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna go down here and shoot you. If you're wondering why I go single player that way, you know, I don't get robbed for my kill or something like that. Oops, missed the entrance. Should be up here somewhere. Shouldn't have went up here. And he disappeared. How great. Oh, what the hell? Son of a bitch. Talk about surprise, huh? This is the easiest way to kill it, though. spawning in every different direction. Yeah, I need to take a walk around. He's already scratched up my arm. Thing. What has happened? My computer is not frozen. Oh, here we go. There we go. Yeah. I 
just ignore that. Um, that's not. Which I chainsaw him. Just chainsaw him right now. Really waste no bullets at all. kills and I'll be on my way to 82 and six more levels probably get it by the time tracking ends Second one jumped in. Got this beautiful guy spread up here. He's probably gonna be dead before I even go my hand on him. I don't know why no one goes for the easy way and just get him stuck or something like that. And everyone just pulls out a machine gun that wastes so much bullets and so much money that it's just unbelievable. You know, all you gotta do is just get the stuff right here and just shoot them. Simple as that, really. Giant spider gets stuck, he won't be so easy to kill. He is one of the toughest, but because of the fact that he could get stuck and his turning radius isn't so big, he's actually became one of the weakest and easiest to kill because of that. As you see here, I'm really using one finger to play. My other hand's just messing around with the Rubik's Cube. I should make a video of that sometime. That's the end of that. God, switch to multiplayer, get ready for the next one. Kano. I guess the guys with the mini guns ran out of bullets. But I really don't know. Oh, there he is.
Come follow me. Right into my trap. bosses once you get them stuck and remove the crowd. Then again he's the only boss that can get stuck so yeah. But if you can't remove him from the crowd or get him stuck he's probably one of the hardest bosses to kill. The second would be the Wrath, Wraith, whatever you want to call it. Mother's easiest Titan follows up, and yeah, that's it. And you know, the burning's obviously a harder than this. I say burning Raph is harder than the giant spider, but the burning spider is way harder than the burning Raph or Rafe, whatever. Why can't they just have some? Good regular names like Tentacle Bitch or some shit like that. Oh well. Is why? Oh shit, I feel it again. Oh shit. Never mind, I'm good. Follow me. Break the trunk. As you see, killing a giant spider is easy. I recommend you guys all just join in and kill this bastard too. Sure. Hmm. Gotta love being a lawyer. Probably at 88, I'll switch out to a doctor. Oh, guys, there you have it.